everyone, welcome to the weekend, our weekend anyway. It is 1.45, we are headed out, we're gonna go run a bunch of errands. I don't know if we really serve errands. <coughs> Dave and I are both getting over being sick. <coughs> I got started getting sick last weekend and then he got sick a couple days after I did, so we're on the mend. But I'm so tired of sitting in the house. I don't even think I left the house one time this week. No, that's a lie. I do a good one for shopping. I didn't leave the house very much this week though, because I've been feeling well. So I'm bored and we're heading out to, right now we're going to the bookstore to return a Bible that my mom got David like for Easter. So it's been sitting in my car for a while. He already has a couple of nice ones, so we're gonna return it. Um, my mom gave me their seat forever ago, so hopefully they still take it back. Then we're gonna go to the mall. We have two free pretzels. Well, David has two free pretzel things for, is it, what's it called, Auntie Anne's? Is that what it's called? One for joining when you download the app on the phone, you get a free pretzel. So if you have one around you and you haven't downloaded the app, download it and you'll get a free pretzel. And then you get one for your birthday too. So he has two. So we're gonna go get some pretzels. I actually went to the mall um, the same day I went grocery shopping and got some stuff at the semi-annual sales, which I have, will have a haul up on Wednesday uh, from Bath & Butters and Victoria's Secret. And I kept smelling the pretzels and ever since then I've wanted one so bad. So we're gonna go get some of those. We might look around. David wants to find a new pair of shoes, right? Yeah. So we might look around and see if we can find a new pair of um, shoes. We're gonna go to Bed Bath & Beyond. Uh, we have, David found, I bought him a Turbis cup. You guys probably saw in the last weekend video at Gander. And he liked it, but he found one at Bed Bath & Beyond that he liked better. So we're gonna turn the one that I bought and he's gonna get this new one. And there's also a gift that I wanna get at Bed Bath & Beyond for my niece. Her birthday is Next weekend, right? Party's on Saturday, I think, so. We got all kinds of fun stuff going on. And then we might make our way back to Gander again. Because we were just there. <laughs> Return the cup and, I don't know, David's... David might buy another fishing pole because he needs one. No, no. You're not going to buy it? You decided? Not if I buy the shoes. No. David's one of those people that as soon as he gets, like, fun spending money, he got to spend it. I said, I think they have a Nike outlet store in Orlando. You should wait because I think we're going to go for the day for my birthday. I said, you should wait and buy it then. He said, you know my money's going to be gone by then. He's got to spend that money. It's like burning a hole in his pocket, which is why I do the budget most of the time. The problem is if I don't spend it on something I want, then I'm going to spend it on food. crap and food and stuff. So I want... David? If I have it, i got to buy something I want. I have a lot of wants, a lot of needs, and I... A lot of needs? What kind of needs you got? Like a new fishing pole, I need a new fishing pole. No, so no, you don't need anything. You crazy. He has a lot of wants. We need to make a list because this is what happens: is he has all these wants, and then Christmas will come, and I say, "What do you want for Christmas?" I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. That doesn't help me. So, so at the bookstore, and they wouldn't return the Bible like I thought they wouldn't because it's been so long. <laughs> They said they would exchange it for equal or lesser value. And David's not a reader, so... No, equal or more. You have to spend more. I don't think so. Yes. Yeah, equal or greater. So, I found this book that I've been wanting because Jillian has it. And every time I, she's at Disney, she has it and I see it. It's a hidden magic of Walt Disney. But it's only twelve ninety five. So, even if I do get it, I still have to find something else that's a couple more bucks. Ugh. This is why you should not wait to return things. I ended up getting the book I was telling you guys about, and then Dave remembered that he wanted some headphones, so he got these headphones, which I don't know how well they're going to be. They're JVC brand, which I don't know if that's the greatest brand. Where are you going? We're going to the mall. Anyway, so we got these two things. These are 10 and this was twelve ninety five. so I ended up just paying the difference. So that's what we got, and now we're going to get some pretzel. Pretzel time. I got a cinnamon pretzel. David got, what'd you get? Butter and salt. A regular pretzel not but in a cup and it was free so we had no luck at the mall trying to find shoes for David so we are at Dick's Sporting Goods and he's looking for a pair of Nikes and he asked me to look and see if there's any coupon codes online so I looked at my Shopular app hopefully you can hear me <laughs> dang plain um, and they're having a 25% off Nike sale so hopefully we'll find something here I think we found a winner Old black nasty ones. New pretty nice black ones. <laughs> Do a little jig, babe. 
lighter. Is that possible? The other shoes are so light. You gonna get them? Yeah. Success. David's very happy with his new shoe purchase, and we just left Gander Mountain to return the cup. He was gonna exchange the cup for a hat that he has on now. Yeah, like this. But, but um, hold on, I'll explain. I'll explain. Okay. Hat identical like this, Columbia, but it's all black all up here, and had a white net netting here. So, but as soon as I got this hat from Maureen for my birthday, as soon as I put it on, I knew I wanted the other one too because I love the way it fits. Looks good it's on you. Perfect. But now I have hat hair because I've been trying to grow my hair out <laughs> and I'm trying to tame it and it's in the awkward stage right now. So we're going to get it right. We're going to get it right. But anyway, they didn't have that hat. Um, we actually went to, we went to Dick's with the <coughs> shoes and we looked there and they had the same hat but they didn't have it in the color he wanted. So it must be a popular color. Um, but he found an orange fishing shirt that he really wanted. So he got that and it, it's orange so it'll match his new hat. I got a so, new stylish. So he's happy. All of his birthday shopping is done now. Almost. And uh, we're heading off. Oh, wow. You have you gotta $9. Spend that nine dollars. So, gotta spend it. You can buy me a drink at dinner. Oh. <laughs> Since you wouldn't buy me my book at the bookstore. I still gave you $5 out of that. Oh, my gosh. Whatever. So, anyway, we're <laughs> headed off to dinner with a friend. We're actually going to pick him up. <laughs> Can you stop popping your like really I'm sick. Hush. I'm sorry. <laughs> so we're gonna pick him up and go to dinner. And we did something really exciting last night that we didn't tell you guys about. Unless you follow me on Instagram, then you know. You don't even know. We booked a trip trip to Disney World. Oh. Woo woo. We're so excited. We're going. We decided we wanted to go to Disney because we've been watching Josh and Joey's vlogs. If you don't watch them, it's uh, it's the bug's life and right that's it it's, yeah, the, bug's life. Yeah. it's the bug's life and um i'll link their video their channel down below we met them at playlist live we love them they work at disney now and they moved down here from alabama light screen and i love disney i've always loved disney i can go to disney anytime and be happy david has never been a huge disney fan and the camera died because i didn't charge it before leaving today so vlogging amateur, amateur, over here. amateur. so anyway like i was saying david has never been a big fan of disney he'll go but he's like not excited about it and i love disney so much and i always wanted to go i really wanted to buy they had a really good deal it was like 150 100 sixty dollars for a four park ticket for Florida residents and they do that normally in the springtime <coughs> and I wanted to do that but David didn't so after watching Josh and Joey's vlogs he really wants to go to Disney now so we decided to book a trip uh, in December we originally thought about booking a trip for our honeymoon not our, what do I always say honeymoon for our anniversary on our anniversary because this our is anniversary. still our anniversary trip but it's not on our anniversary Can I, I haven't finished talking yet Anywho, before you really interrupt me, we, our anniversary is in November. So the Christmas party actually starts the day of our anniversary, which is November 10th. But I'm thinking if we're going to go and go to the Christmas party, I'd rather go after Thanksgiving and really be in the Christmas spirit because I know if I go to Disney and we go to the Christmas party, I'm going to want to come home and decorate the house and David's going to be about that. We're so, going to have the house decorated by the time we go. Yeah, because we're going in December. Exactly. I don't understand. So we're it's kind of like our anniversary trip, but it's in December instead of November. So we're going right now we have a booked for the first weekend in December. We're planning on going up earlier during the week, but we're gonna stay probably at two different hotels and I have to make the first reservation separate from the reservation I uh, made originally. But I'm really excited. Um, we're going for if we go during the week, it's going to be Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, five days. We're going to go to Hollywood Studios because I want to see all the lights. And then we're going to go to the Christmas party, the very Merry Christmas party, which is at Magic Mickey's. Kingdom. And those are all the park stuff we're going to do. We really wanted to spend a full day at the resort relaxing. We've never stayed at Disney Resort together. We're staying at Port Orleans Riverside. I pretty much fell in love when I went and saw Amanda up there. Um, was it last month or the month before? So... We're staying there. I'm super excited. One day and I want to go to one of those resorts where the the, the one where the train thing right goes through it. What is that talking? What is that? 
Oh gosh, that's the... Oh. What's it? Grand Floridian? Is that it? I don't know if that's a hotel. I know you're talking about them. But um, we'll probably go to all of the resorts and see all the cruise <laughs> displays and things like that while we're there. We kind of want it to be like a relaxing, fun vacation. So I'm so to, excited. I want to get a massage. 137 days until our vacation. I can't wait to get a magic band. I've never had a magic band before. And I've gone to Orlando probably like four or five times now and have not gone to the parks. It's either didn't to visit Jillian, to visit Amanda. Okay, we probably could have made that light that you just sent a big phone for. Oh, my arm is getting tired holding this dang phone. So we're also thinking possibly while we're there, if we have time, maybe we'll do a meetup. Yes, we should. But I don't know how many of you would be interested in meeting us. Let us know. Um, maybe we could do like downtown Disney or. We should never call it a meetup. We should just call it a hangout. Like, kind of planet where Josh and Joey and like anybody. Josh and Joey, we've there. decided you're gonna come and we're gonna have a meetup together. Like a hangout <laughs> meetup. Like, yeah, like, obviously. Like Colin and Katie did at Target. That was awesome. I guess that was a meetup. Yeah. We'll meet. We'll meet up. We'll say hi. Hey, how's it going? We'll walk around. We'll get some ice cream. We'll hang out. It'll be good times. So that's obviously kind of a ways in the future, but if you're interested in doing something like that, let us know. Um, I mean, it's Christmas at Disney, so I'm sure a lot of people will be going to vacation there because hello, it's Christmas at Disney. So it's three of my all-time favorite things, David, Disney, and Christmas. Could it get any better? I don't think so. I'm just missing the Remy doll. If Remy could go, it would be better, but I'm so excited. So. We just left. Maureen successfully backed us out of the parking lot. We did not hit any cars besides that one. But, I don't know why you say that. Um, I'm a we, while we were at Brass Ring, our blue, favorite place. Blue, uh, we blew Honda Civic and you were parked at Brass Ring tonight. You, that wasn't us. And you're not even looking. You're not even pointing the I camera am, I'm, at I'm, me. We're all looking at it. Look. All right. So <laughs> while we were there, before we got our food, our friends Chrissy and Aaron showed up. And we were joking around, said we we're gonna go to Renegades, and they said, All right, and now we're gonna go to Renegades. So, we've gotta go home and walk the Remy girl. Gotta drop this we Gotta drop back. Kevin off. And then we're gonna go home and get ready and walk the dog and then head to Renegades. So, that's awesome. Give me some spice. Oh, Glitter. on. Glitters. Everyone just is unsubscribed because they see your face. <laughs> Boom. So welcome to Sunday. We're at my parents' house having Father's Day lunch. Look, that wasn't posed at all. No. <laughs> we have <coughs> we have steak, baked potatoes, salad, brownies, salad. I made brownies. Not really Didn't I made brownies. Very yummy. Yeah. Hanging yeah. out, having family time with the deer oh, head. Uh, Dylan. And then you can What's the deer's name? They're Felix. on their phones. Felix. <clears throat> Felix. Felix the deer that David found. We're gonna go trade my camera. My camera my is still dead. Cam Look at what happened to David's nose last night. Oh, yeah, got into got a it. fight at the bar. With what, the bar? With the ice cube. <laughs> 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 we just made it back home. I didn't film too much at my parents' house because we were all just kind of hanging on the couch and talking and spending time together. It was really nice to be over there with my parents. And uh, we just got back home and I wanted to show you guys a gift that I received in the P.O. Box this week. I'm really excited about it. It's really pretty. So I was sent this really cool, uh, you hang it, like, you can hang it really anywhere, but I would probably hang it on my front door. And it's in the shape of a mason jar and it says, welcome y'all. And it is freaking adorable. I love it. Um, Walker Girl Boutique sent it to me. There is their information. I'll link all this down low, uh, down below if you guys want to check them out. They have an Etsy shop. And they're also on Facebook and Instagram. I actually found them on Instagram and liked some of their pictures. And then she said that she was going to send me something. So I thought that was so sweet. How freaking cute is this? I've actually seen these mason jar 
things on Etsy before and I've always thought about ordering one but I just never did. So I'm super happy to have this. Thank you guys for sending it to me. It's so sweet of you. And they have a bunch of other stuff on their um, Etsy site as well. So if you guys are interested in things that aren't just mason jar, definitely check them out. They have some really cool stuff. So I wanted to share that with you guys. Um, so yeah, that's what came in the PO box. What's up y'all? Lauren and I were in bed. Well, I guess we weren't really in bed. We were watching TV though. Yeah, we were watching Roman out in the vlogs. Yeah, we were watching some vlogs. And then we decided, hey, let's go get some ice cream because it's Sunday Thank and you not you Monday. decided that though. David, strict diet tomorrow, so today's my last Yeah, David we decided. Say that. No, you always say that. No, you and always say Monday. that. I never say <laughs> that. On Monday, you're like, no. I David never has said. said he's gonna go on a diet, and I have been kind of on a diet, but I haven't been as strict lately because I was sick, and so I need to get back on track. And I was actually thinking when we left my parents' house, I was like, man, Dairy Queen sounds really good, and it's kind of on the way home. But I didn't say anything, so I was like, you know what, we had brownies today, like, we don't need to get ice cream. And then when we got home, David's like, I want something sweet. And he said, I really want Dairy Queen. And I can't say no to Dairy Queen, so we're going back out <laughs> and getting some ice cream. But this is it, for real. For real, real. Till real. next weekend. No, <laughs> I'm done. I really need to... Plus we have two things coming up, but we're going to be in bathing suits. So we have 4th of July, we're going to the lake, and then um, later in July we're going on a family vacation. So, gotta be looking somewhat good. <laughs> We're not going to be perfect, that's for sure. Summer body is made in the winter, not in the summer. We're a little late. We're late to the game. We're home. We're calling it a night. We hope that you guys enjoyed our weekend vlog. Hopefully we're both in the frame because we are. most of the time we're not. We are. But anyway, if you guys, what is she doing? If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave us a comment. Let us know how your Father's Day went and what you guys did. And we'll see you all next weekend. Bye, guys. Peace.